Collaboration is a word you don't hear often, and that's too bad. When I was working on my master's degree in public administration with a public lands emphasis, my advisor and friend, John Freemuth, talked a lot about why collaboration worked, even though we didn't have a lot of examples at the time. In collaboration, you bring all the stakeholders to the table to find out what they already agree on. Now, usually in public lands collaboration, the agreement is that they love public lands. Then you work on the areas where the parties aren't too far apart, and you find out what their bottom line needs are, and when it works, and it is often working these days, I'm proud to report, nobody walks away completely happy, but everyone can point to something that they influenced for their constituency. You can call it compromise if you'd rather. I deeply believe in collaboration and working together toward a compromise all sides can agree on. There's only one exception. I'm not willing to compromise on human rights. You shouldn't be treated differently because you're a different color, because of your religion or your lack of religion or because of who you love. So collaboration and compromise, yes. The exception is human rights. We're all equal, period.